Caroline Dubois versus Melina Koleva. Who do y'all think is going to win this fight? To those who don't know who Caroline Dubois is, she is the younger sister of heavyweight contender Daniel Dynamite Dubois, Triple D. Um, yeah, Dubois and Covella will be uh, fighting uh, this coming weekend, this coming Saturday on the 10th of September, September 10, 2022. Live over at the O2 in London, in the UK, in the undercard of the Clarissa Shields versus Savannah Marshall fight. A uh, historic event consisting of uh, female fighters uh, fighting from around the world. Uh, the co future, the co main event is between Mayer and Baumgartner. You don't want to miss this event. To be shown live on Sky Sports for the UK fight fans and to be shown live here in the States on ESPN. It's a great event, great card. And uh, I'm very excited to see how uh, the event will play out. And uh, and I'm looking forward to this one between uh, Dubois and Koleva. Uh, six rounds in the lightweight division. To those who don't know who Caroline Dubois is, she's 21 years old. Like I said, she's the younger sister of Triple D. Um, 33 and 0, two wins coming by way of knockout TKO. She turned pro uh, earlier this year against Veda Masikoyaite. Am I pronouncing that right? Um, and she's won three fights so far as a professional. And um, yeah, all three fights took place this year. And she's going in there against uh, Koleva, who is a 34 year old fighter born in Bulgaria, uh, but now residing in Germany, at least according to BoxRec. Uh, she's also known as Hell's Baby. Her name is, I mean, her record is 10 wins, 14 losses, one draw, four wins coming by way of knockout TKO. She's coming off three losses in a row against Eva Brodnika, D. Allen, and Lucy Sedlakova. She's also been been in there against the likes of Mava Hamaduch back in 2017, Katie Taylor in 17, uh, 2017, and Hamaduch again in 2017. Um, she also fought uh, Delphine Pursun back in 2011. So she's fought some really good names over her career. Obviously, uh, lost most of them by um, lost to most of the fighters that she's fought. Uh, as you guys can tell by her record of 14 losses. And now she's going in there against the younger, stronger, faster, and more skilled Caroline Dubois. So <laughs> you guys know who I'm picking, right? Uh, so when it comes to this fight, that uh, Caroline Dubois should be should be too good for uh, Koleva. Um, right now, I mean Dubois is just getting the experience she needs. She's the A side. She's the main fighter. She's the uh, fighter they're trying to promote. Um, she should be able to go out there and answer the uh, and uh, dominate and put on a one-sided uh, beatdown, whether it's by TK or knockout or by decision. Um, I, I'm very confident Dubois will, will win this fight. I'll be shocked and surprised if she somehow loses this one. Uh, Koleva seems like she's a tough fighter out of her 14 losses. I think she only lost three by TK or knockout. Yep, just three. So so yeah, it will be interesting to see if uh, uh, Caroline will be one of the uh, few people that has stopped or knocked out uh, Koleva, which I think he will, she will. I think Caroline Dubois definitely has the power and uh, the technique to uh, to hurt and stop Kuleva. But I could be wrong. I've been wrong many times before. Anything is possible in the sport of boxing. I say Dubois TKO round number three. That's what I think. But we shall see. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening and watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.